Good morning, everybody. Lance here, Harley Davis, Newport Ritchie, in the thriving metropolis of Newport Ritchie. Hey, uh, this morning I'm here to shed a little light on light bulbs. Okay, bub, get a close up here. I want to show show everybody. All right, this is your traditional 1156. This is your traditional 1157. You can see the difference in the little nubs there on the side. These are called bayonet style bulbs. All right. There are automotive uh, options for this. However, if you take a look at automotive versus Harleys, Harleys are gonna be, have heavier uh, filaments. All right, you also see supports in there. This is a slot style bulb. Also for your turn signals and or brake lights. This would be a passing lamp bulb. These bulbs get very, very hot. So are the ones in your headlamps. What you want to do is you want to keep your fingers off the glass because the oils and acids in your, in your fingertips can etch the glass when they heat up and cause them to blow out quicker. All right. If you do get your fingers on the glass, by all means, use rubbing alcohol, also known as isopropyl alcohol, and clean them off when you get them installed into, the, into, your, um, into your lamps. One of the things that you want to do with this as well is we have dielectric grease, but also known as electrical contact lubricant. You want to put it here on the ground. You can also put it on the positive. It won't draw that enough uh, electricity to cause any issues, but it will help stop oxidation. So that way it remains um, clean so that you always have a good contact with your bulbs. If you have any questions, please give us a call 727-842-4547 or stop on in at 5817 State Road 54 in Newport Ritchie. Thanks for watching and have yourself a rockin' Harley day.